Pretty cool text animation, right? Let me show you how to create it. So all we need in order to create such a cool write-on animation is this text plus title. Just drag and drop this over to your timeline and then change the text to whatever you like. Let's just go with vlog01 and then change the font. I find this cool Binjay font. If you like this font, I'll leave a link to that in the description of this video. It is free to use and you can just download it and use it in your own videos. So then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna extend the size quite a bit. What I'm gonna do then is in the inspector, click on this fusion icon and this will load up this whole animation in the fusion page. So the next step in order to make this right on, we need a mask. And for this specific one, let's go to this text or template and then hit shift spacebar and type in mask paint and then just click on add. And by default, the text will disappear. And that is because we have to go to mask in the inspector and select invert. So we can actually see our text. Then by default, this is set to a multi-stroke and we wanna change this to a single stroke Let's set this to single stroke and then go back to your inspector, go back to controls and go to brush controls. And now we want to set the size to something that covers our whole stroke. Because if you see this green circle, this is basically the brush size. And if I were to drag right now, you see that this won't cover the whole letter. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit control C to undo, then go to controls, then increase the size to around 0.5 and then lower the softness to 0.001, basically no softness. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to stroke controls. This is pretty important as well. And we want to change the stroke animation from all frames to right on. And now with this being done, go to frame number zero. And we have a bunch of options right now to do this animation. The way that I like to do is if I'm just going to cover the whole word, in one single stroke. And that's also the easiest way to do, no separate animations whatsoever, but if you want, you can create every single letter one by one. It's a little more time consuming and the results will just be the same as if we were to do it in one single stroke. Let's go to frame number zero, left click and hold and just paint over this whole animation. something like that and now it is completely gone. And if you watch the timeline down there, you see that we have created a bunch of keyframes, but we can't see anything. And if I were to hit play right now, you see that this would write off. And that's because we have to go to mask and then uncheck invert. And right now you see that this starts writing on. But this is pretty slow and as you can see, this doesn't even cover the whole word. So if you go to keyframes now, we can see that these keyframes will extend outwards of the whole template. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up the mask paint, go to stroke one and then end. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna left click and box this up and then I'm gonna right click and go to time stretching, which will box this up nicely. And then I'm gonna go to the end and I'm gonna left click and drag this down so that it fits inside of this animation. And if I were to go to frame zero and hit play, oh, let me get rid of this mask. you see that it's writing on very nicely. And that's all you need to do to create the nice write on effect. So guys, that's a wrap. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If so, please consider leaving a like and a subscribe if you haven't already to not miss out on any upcoming content in the future, but also to help me spread out this video to even more people that might be interested in that specific topic. So with that being said, guys, hope you all have a great day. See you in the next one. Bye.